When a commercial seller breaches a contract with a commercial buyer, the breach may leave the buyer struggling to meet its performance goals and fulfill its own obligations to third parties. If circumstances render it infeasible for the buyer to purchase replacement goods, can courts force the seller to fulfill its contractual obligations? This question regarding the remedy of specific performance in breach of contract cases is what we explore in Curtis Brothers Company v. Katz. Curtis Brothers, a business that canned tomatoes, contracted with James Katz to purchase all of the tomatoes produced on a specified acreage of Katz's property. The tomato canning season lasted six weeks. Knowing that its factory had the capacity to pack approximately one million cans during that six-week window, Curtis Brothers engaged in extensive preseason preparations. In addition to securing labor and necessary equipment, Curtis Brothers also entered into multiple contracts, including the one with Katz, to secure an adequate supply of tomatoes to fully utilize the factory's capacity. When Katz later breached the party's contract by refusing to supply tomatoes, Curtis Brothers filed a suit against Katz in the Court of Chancery of New Jersey, a court of equity, seeking specific performance.